We need our red TheraBand and our anti-burst ball. We'll tie the red TheraBand a quarter of the way into our foam roller. And we'll start with our dominant leg, and I'll say this again, our dominant leg farthest away from the wall. Holding the anti-burst ball and the red TheraBand, I step onto the roller, placing the ball between my inner thighs. Knee soft. I've wrapped my outside hand, the red TheraBand around the knuckles with the thumb on the outside. I'm going to brace my abs. Inhale, exhale, sit back into a squat. I'll shift over to my outside leg, kicking the inside heel to my butt, holding for two breaths at the bottom. Join me. Here we go. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, inner thighs pull me back. I shift to my outside leg, and the inside heel comes towards my butt. Inhale one, breathe. Exhale one. Inhale two. Exhale two. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, lower the shin that was lifted. Knees soft. Inhale, prepare. No movement. Exhale, inner thighs pull you back. Inhale, shift over. Exhale, hold. Inhale two. Exhale two. Inhale, standing up on that one leg. Exhale, lower the inside leg. One more time. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, sit back. Outside arm is in shoulder flexion as I shift over. Inhale and exhale, hold. Inhale, pelvis grounds down towards the roller. Exhale, inner thighs pull back. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, lower the shin of the lifted leg. Grab the ball, stepping off the roller safely, so slowly, good. And now let's make our way to the second side. Setting up, ball between the inner thighs, wrapping around the knuckles with the thumb on the outside, hand on the wall bar or counter for safety purposes. And when you're ready, inhale, prepare. Exhale, sit back. Inhale, hold it back. Shifting over to that outside leg, kicking the inside heel to your butt, toes pointed. Inhale. Brace the abs. Exhale the air out. <sighs> Inner thighs pulling back. Inhale, stand up as the pelvis pulls towards the roller. Don't lock the knee out. Exhale, lower the shin that was lifted. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, inner thighs pull you back. Shifting over to that outside leg. Kicking the heel to the butt. Hold it here. Toes are pointed. Inhale, one. Breathe. Exhale, one. Inhale, two. Exhale, two. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, lower the shin that was lifted. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, inner thighs pull you back. Inhale, shifting over. Exhale, the air out. Inhale. And exhale. <sighs> Inhale, standing up. Lower that shin down. Slowly stepping off of your roller. We're going to take a quick release. I'd like you to foam roll your IT band. So you're going to come down and we're going to Roll out this area. I'll show you with my hand. Start with your dominant leg first. Forearm is down. Really use your abs here. Take the top hand either to the hip or behind the head. I like behind the head because then you can rest your head back into it. Lifting the chin to engage your neck flexors. As we move forward and back, just think about initiating the walking forward and back with your abs so that the limbs, especially the shoulder joint, doesn't take all the weight as you work through that tight fascia, oh, IT band, lateral hamstring area. Let's breathe together. We're going to four. Inhale one, breathe. Exhale one. Inhale two. Exhale two. Inhale three. Exhale three. Inhale four. Exhale four slowly, switch sides, setting up, rest the head back into the hammock of your hand, plug your shoulders down, soften the front ribs inward, don't let them push forward. Where's the belly? Pull it in towards the spine. You can twist forward, you can twist back, you can do circular motions, you can walk forward and back, you could just stay in one spot. So many options. Four more breaths here. Inhale one, breathe. Exhale one. Inhale two. Exhale two. Inhale three. Exhale three. Inhale four. Exhale four. Beautiful. We're going to make our way up to stand. We need our three pound weight and our foam roller coming by the wall for a step to balance in the transverse plane. Now watch me one time. I'll show you the arm. The arm stays fixed. The elbow at the side of the body. The forearm is flat. Once I find my balance in this 
pose, I'm going to move the forearm in and out. So you know what the arm's doing now. Isometric hold for the step to balance. I start facing the wall with my dominant leg closest to the roller. I quarter turn up into knee flexion. So my inside leg comes up and I test the balance. Once I've mastered the balance, I can put one or two fingers of my inside hand on the wall as I move that arm in and out three times. Then we'll repeat. Join me. Here we go. Step to balance, pointed toes, knee flexion, neutral pelvis, find the balance. Soft bend in the supporting knee. Now one finger or so on the wall as you open the forearm and close the forearm or close and open depending on how you had it when you step to balance. Three times, once you've completed that, slowly step off, same side, repeating one more time. Stepping up to balance, now transverse plane step to balance is really important. This is where 90% of injuries occur. So training in this way can help prevent major, major injuries and we all know that that's really important. As you're working here, stay lifted through your center. You can always have a couple fingers on there as you open and close that forearm. All right, let's take it to the other side. Setting up on the other side, being very careful on this side since this is your weaker leg you're stepping up onto. Soft bend in the knee, keep your focus up higher than eye level, test the balance, and then move the arm out or in three times, keeping the elbow and upper arm connected to the side of your body the entire time. It's just the forearm that's moving with the wrist flat. Soften your sternum inward, pull the shoulder blades together. Beautiful, step down one more time. Step to balance, find it, hold it, and now the arm moves. Two, three, four, and back. Two, three, four, take it out. Two, three, four, and in. Two, three, four, one more out. Two, three, four, in. Two, three, four, set. Let's slowly come off the roller, setting the weight to the side. Come over to your wall, bring your dominant arm into a cactus. Twist away from that arm, stepping the inside leg back for a calf stretch. This time we'll internally rotate the back leg. So turn the leg in in the hip socket so the toes face in towards your body pigeon toed, still driving the pelvis forward. You wanna lean forward with your upper body and then twist away from the arm on the wall for your pec minor here. Breathe with me, inhale one, Exhale one, going to six. Inhale two, drive the pelvis forward. You wanna feel the outer calf stretching, your leg closest to the wall. We'll say that was three breaths. Inhale four, exhale four. Inhale five, exhale five. Inhale six, slowly face the wall, stepping the leg in, bringing the other arm to a cactus, twisting away. Stepping the inside leg back, pull the abs in, internally rotate that back leg from the hip socket, micro bend in the knees, driving the pelvis forward as you twist from your torso. Plug your shoulders down, lift your chin, gaze is always higher than eye level. Widen the collarbone, pull the shoulder blades together, hear that breath. Imagine my hands on your shoulder blades, puff the back ribs towards my hands. Plug those shoulders down, there we go. Breathe, inhale one, exhale one. Just three more breaths here. Inhale two, exhale two, inhale three, exhale three. And let's bring our tailbone against the wall. So step your feet into this penguin position where your heels are together and your toes are fist distance apart. We'll just do a nice release for the upper back. What I'd like you to do is keeping the tailbone connected to the wall and the low belly firm, allow your upper body to fold forward. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, let the arms pendulum away from each other. Two, three, four. Inhale, pause the movement. Lift up through your lower abs. Exhale, circle the arms out. Two, three, four. Tailbone is connected to the wall. Knees are soft. Inhale, arms circle out. The neck relaxes. Two, three, four. Two more. Inhale. Brace the abs, circle those arms, two, three, four, and inhale. Brace the abs, circle those arms, two, three, four. Great job. 